What's good in the woods, everybody? Magnum73 here, and we're going to be playing Deer Hunter, the 2005 season. And what I'd like to do today is actually recreate some of the weapons from the Hunter Classic and see how they stack up in this game. So for the first two weapons, I've recreated the 4570 lever action rifle and the 300 bolt action rifle. Two powerful rifles I like to use pretty often than the Hunter. And we're going to take these out to Georgia to go hunting for some trophy whitetail. We'll go ahead and get these two equipped. That'll do it. Today's goal is to try to get a world record class whitetail. Uh, I tried to look for one in the last episode but had no luck, but we're going to try it again today and hopefully have some luck. We're going to be hunting in the post rut season of Georgia, and so let's see what happens. And we got our first buck here. We're looking at a 10 pointer. Not a bad looking one either. We'll go ahead and get the antlers out and rattle them in. And as you can see, post rut Georgia has a little bit of a different appearance compared to the rut season and pre-rut. We're going to put some synth stomper on, even though we got the wind blowing behind us. I don't guess he's going to stop. We're going to take him out with a lever action rifle. I got the 4570 here. I'm going to put a shot on him. And we definitely hit him. I'm not sure how good though. I assume he's still running. There he goes, in the distance. Yeah, so if that was a vital hit, he would have slowed down like five seconds after shooting him. And that's not the case, so we're going to have to go over there and get some blood and track him down. That was a little underwhelming for the 4570 lever action rifle. I was expecting a little bit more uh, power. But maybe I just didn't put a good shot on him. We'll see. And we should come across some blood here soon. We got some tracks, and there's the blood. The blood should take us right to him, and a follow-up shot might be necessary. We'll see. I was able to catch up with that 10-pointer, and we got him just up ahead. I've been trying to rattle him in, but that doesn't appear to be happening right now. As I've already shot him, and I think after you shoot an animal in this game, the colors lose their ability to attract, so... We'll go ahead and put a follow-up in him. We'll line him up. And we got him again. Yeah, shouldn't be an issue going down after that. Yep, yeah, he's slowing down. Right, so with this being the 4570, I was hoping that one shot would have been enough, but I had to put two in him. But like I said, maybe my shot placement was off. I might have hit in it the intestine rather than the lung. So next time we use it, we'll try to go for a kill shot. And here is our 10 point buck. It's our first buck with a 4570 lever action rifle. Had to put two shots in him, but he's dead here. Yeah, a good looking one. Pick him up. And he scores 134.1, weighing at 139 pounds. Not bad. Here we're looking at a 12 point buck. And it says he's non typical, but I don't see how that's the case. He is betting right now, which is pretty common during the post rut season. Just looking around me right now to make sure I'm not missing anything. Oh, never mind, I think I see a drop time. Huh, that's cool. Alright, we're gonna try to rattle him in. I'd like him to get up at least before we take a shot at him. Put some scent stopper on. I don't guess getting up is going to be a possibility anytime soon. I think I'm just going to take the shot anyways. We'll use the 4570 lever action rifle yet again, and since he is still, I have a feeling we'll put a good shot on him. He's hit. I was hoping that would have been effective. He's not slowing down. Oh, got a follow up on him, and he slid on that one. <laughs> it's quite dramatic, but we got him. Alright, we'll go pick him up. And we got him right here. 
Yeah, you can see the drop time there. Very nice. And he scores... 135.6. Weighing at 194 pounds. Let's take a look at him in the trophy lodge, or the trophy room, excuse me. He has a drop time on both sides, actually. Oh, that's good looking. Yeah, the perfect drop time buck. 12 pointer. Taken at 123 yards. Not bad. And on to the typical, we have the 134 that we got. Weighing at 139 pounds. I already mentioned that. Taken at 118 yards with the 4570. This time around, I'm going to get rid of the 4570. And we're going to replace it with a 270 bolt action rifle. Another familiar favorite from the Hunter Classic. And I'm going to try to create it as identical to the one in the Hunter Classic as I possibly can. We got a standard varnish with a 4x12 scope, and we're going to chamber it in 270, of course. And we'll be using this along with a 300 since I didn't get to use it last hunt. It's definitely going to be funny if it outperforms the 4570. We'll see how it goes. And as you can see, we have a decent sized 6 point buck here in front of us. Probably the biggest one I've seen in the game so far, to be honest. So I'm going to try to get him to stop, and this time around, I'd like to take him with a 300 bolt action rifle. Haven't used it yet. This would be a good time to do that. And let's shoot him. He was at a little bit of a weird angle there, but I'm pretty sure I got a good hit on him. I lost sight of him. Oh, never mind. There he is in the distance. And he is slowing down, so that's a good sign. That's what I wanted to see. And he'll go down right there. Yeah, so at least we know so far that the 300 is going to perform satisfactory. Let's go see him. Yeah, not a bad looking six pointer at all. Ooh. Left quite the entry wound on him. And he scores 155.5 for a six pointer. That's the biggest buck I've gotten so far in the sun, so yeah, I'll take it. And I have a record book 10 point buck here across the river. He is on the move right now, so we'll rattle a little bit to get him to stop. And I figured this would be a good opportunity to use a 270 bolt action rifle, so let's give it a go. And we hit him. I think we got him good, actually. Yeah, he's slowing down. He just went out of render there, but I do believe he will go down. So let's go catch up to him. Get and here he is. He did go down. He's our first buck with a 270. And a good one at that. And he scores. 177.3, weighing at 236 pounds. Yeah, by far a good scoring record book. We're going to go take a look at him in the trophy room. First up, we have our record book buck scoring at 177.3, taking at 142 yards with the 270 bolt action rifle. A very good looking buck. We got two deductions on the left antler, but a good buck nevertheless. And on to our six pointer that we got, scoring at 155.5. Taking out 104 yards with a 300 bolt action rifle. And so for the next weapon I'm going to be using from the Hunter Classic, we're going to be using the 12 gauge shotgun. So I'm going to make it as close to it as I can. And we're going to take it out to Georgia and hunt a big buck with it. And when I spawned in, I actually saw something run in that direction, and it looked to be pretty big, so we're going to be going that way and see if I can find it. Here we go. <laughs> A world record buck. 12 points. Hey man, he is massive. Just look at the spread on him. I almost forgot about the excitement of finding a world record buck in this game. Just uh, when you see it in the hunting guests, there's just something about the feeling. And I'm experiencing that all over again. It's really cool. 
and I am gonna rattle him in. We're gonna try to get him with a 12 gauge shotgun. And I'd say we definitely got his attention. All right, it's time to get up close and personal with this beast. Hey, we're moving in slowly now, we're prone. He's approaching. The wind is pretty good right now, shouldn't be an issue. We're just gonna move in slowly and take our time with this. I do want to get as close as possible to have an effective range with the shotgun. I don't think that moment's gonna be quite now. Let's get him to stop. Alright, it's now or never. <laughs> Whoa, dropped him. I'm not gonna lie, that was satisfying. Seeing that guy go down. Went straight down. And here he is. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a world record whitetail. It's been a while since I've gotten a world record in this game. It's a good feeling. He scores 205.6, weighing at 143 pounds. That's kind of funny. The record book actually weighed more than he did. <laughs> but nevertheless, it's a world record book. Let's go take a look at him. We got him here in the trophy room. Scoring at 205.6, taking at 41 yards with a 12 gauge shotgun. A 12 pointer. And we're gonna hopefully get other species down the line. Cause when we do, we get a trophy for that. This has been really enjoyable. I've had fun and I hope you guys have enjoyed the video as well. And let me know in the comments section which species you want me to go after next. I'm probably going to do mule deer, because muleys can get pretty big in this game. So we're probably going to try to tackle that next. But leave me suggestions, and thank you for watching as always, and until next time.